Hello everyone, how are they doing? I hope everything is going smooth today for you. Um, let me introduce myself. My name is Cielo Mesquita. I live in London. I currently live in London. I study general psychology. That was my undergraduate and my have a postgraduate diploma in forensic psychology. Um so you must be asking what is the reason of this lovely person to say out to explain her resume. Well the reason is that I want to promote this new project, to promote this new idea called Behind a Smile. Um the main motto is to battle depression through education. Um currently you can follow us on Facebook and Twitter and this project is aiming to help everyone, literally everyone, relatives, family, someone who knows someone who's battling with depression. And also, I want to not only share my story, I uh, have been battling with depression for, well, it seems all my life, but mainly I have been struggling the most the last two and a half years. Um, Depression is not something that it should be taken slightly. It's not something that is going to go away, sadly. It's something that we need to fight and we need to know and we need to know that there's people out there who will support us and who will love us and who will make us get out of it. Um I have experienced a lot of stigma, I have experienced a lot of bullying, I have experienced a lot of ignorance and that has been my my motor to keep going and to say no this is not how it's supposed to be we cannot pretend that nothing, nothing is happening and we cannot pretend that you can just go to your GP, take a pill and it's going to solve everything magically, no the reason I have um, I have not give up is because of you guys. It's because of all the people out there who are in my situation, you know, who have no one to talk about, have no information regarding what to do because you assume that it's normal that you feel sad all day, that you're not able to do things, that you're not functioning well, and you are changing who you are. And it's a transition period, but also it's a disease. And you guys can help me, just a humble and low-key person, to raise a voice and to say, depression. And we need to change. There's a lot of people who will say, come on, you just get over with. I have, I have heard get over with so many times. No. It's... I cannot get over it because it's in my head, it's in my whole body. I haven't been able to be the person that I was and I I know that out of this and with your help I'm going to be a better person than I ever imagined. But in order to do that I need your support. I need you to say I have depression, I know someone with depression, this is happening and not just say it and then move away, I'm going to be here always for you I always, I can assure you that I have nothing else to do just to care about other people and I care, and I care about everyone you matter, you are worth it you are beautiful, and you have something to share we, we as a society lately, we have put out all our values on other people's expectations, of other people's way of thinking, of other people's way of of being. And this is not a game. And you may say, well, if you have something so important to say, why don't you do it properly? Why don't you dress better? Why don't your hair is at least made a certain way that you look appealing? Or your hair, you just wash your face and then you just put your computer and then you randomly start to talk about it. 
What is the point? Why do you have some connections? Because I have nothing to hide. I have I have no desire or looking appealing or trying to reach a goal or trying to look in a certain way. That is not the point. The point is what I'm saying and I suffer depression. I have tried to kill myself. I have done self harm and I have nothing to have and I have nothing to be ashamed of. I'm not ashamed of what I do. I'm not ashamed of trying to kill myself because things are bad. I have nothing to hide. And you can see me with my, without my hair done, with my hair done. And all those things, the physical things have no value. You know why? Because at the end of the day, when you are alone in your room and you are alone in a space, all of the things go away. And it's not what other people think about you or how other people feel about you. It's how you feel about myself. And this is how I feel about myself. This is who I am. I am a human being. And I have value. But currently I am not able to see it. Because other things. Because my disease, my background, everything. I have a horrible um, emotional background. I had the luxury of having material things. And not have it to struggle financially. And most pe for most people, that is enough reason to say, well, if you have never struggled financially, you have no right to be depressed. Depression has nothing to do with money or not money. It has to do with who you are. And it has to do that the people around you. It has to do with the environment you were in. It has to do with certain things that have made you feel this this way of have this disease but there's a way out of it there's a way out of it I survive I survive when I try to kill myself nobody helped me I helped me because when I was doing it and when I was going through that I thought I need to help other people so I have right now I have nothing to lose so you can use this forum this is your space and you can use my skills to get out of it, to share about it, to create awareness. This is not going to be just another um, random videos. And it's not going to be another forum so you can say, oh my god, people are so mean, they are so ignorant. No, we, got, we are going to make something out of it. We are going to say, no, I'm not going to get out of it. I need your help. I need you to tell me that I that you love me 100, 2,000, and as many times. Why? Because that's what you need right now. So, let's make it happen, people. And let's make a difference. Because every one of you have the power to make a difference. In your life and in mine. And if you are willing to do it, I'm more than happy and more than humble. To receive your message so you have any doubts regarding my background regarding my qualifications because obviously I'm not going to post that on online because it's way too risky but if you have any doubts anything that you want to share good bad any criticism that you have say it say it in a respectful manner say it in a way that I can improve this and don't care about hair, makeup, weight, anything about that. This is not how it is. This is about something more deeply. Something so inside of us that no, not all the people are willing to go there. And I have to go there and I have came out of it. And I know that you can. So, again, I hope that this information helps you inspire you and I love you all and I wish you all the best remember you're worth it